All right, everyone, here we are with ticker symbol GNUS. Last time I did this video, uh, this ticker uh, symbol was actually below the 50 day moving average. And what a turn of events. It brought itself back up over the 50 day moving average, fighting to stay up there, brought back down and teared right through. So before I get started on speaking more detail of this specific stock, um, I do want to state there are no emotions involved and I do not get paid for speaking about specific stocks. Just simply charts and seeing what the charts have to tell us. What an incredible run. The first thing I do want to point out is the move of this stock. This stock is currently moving in an upward trend. Um, the bulls tore through the 50 day moving average. They throw, tore through all types of resistance levels. And you can also see in my last video, the resistance level that I had uh, posted and the support level. And it just bounced right back up. Um, then it started bringing itself back down. Maybe people started taking their profits um, or they just started to uh, fear or the bears just started to take over. So the bulls at the end of it all started to tear back through and bring this one back up almost to $5 at $4.90. So I'm going to go ahead and zoom in so that we can take a close look at our resistance level and our support level for this stock. So, so our resistance level here. That. Bear with me one second, guys. I'm sorry about the, the weight here. Just watching me move this around. But um, that is our resistance level. And our support level is way down here. So this stock is looking bullish just by the fact that it closed out above the 50-day moving average and maintaining itself up there it tore through it more than once but the bulls have fought for it so the first thing i want us to look at is our support level here for this stock this support level here is four dollars and 41 cents four dollars and 41 cents that's what we'll be looking at for this stock right here. I gotta move this one back down actually. It'll be misleading, but actually no, it'll just fall up against here. Let's, let's put this right. Out. All right. Oh my gosh, so much trouble. <laughs> All right, so. The support level is 441 and that was touched just once and it brought itself back up. The resistance level, it was broken through two times throughout the day, at the beginning of the day and somewhere around the middle of the day, which is $5.69. The 50-day moving average is slightly falling below it and it got torn through and it's actually four dollars and 72 cents so right here we are at a fight between the bulls and the bears the bulls brought it back up the bears leveled it out the bulls can use this as a stair step to keep going but they got a long way to go until they can get over to the resistance level that needs to be broken which is five dollars and seventy cents if the bulls can get up here 
and further away from the 50-day moving average, the bulls will continue to gain control, turn the $5.70 into their new support level and break new resistance levels. But as of right now, this is a bullish chart. The bears are losing. And some important key factors here is $4.41 for the support level. Keep a real close eye on that stock for that one. And $5.70. Once that wall is torn and broken through, the bears can start to continue moving up, building new resistance levels and using 570 as their support level. Um, as this stock continues to move upward, this line will continue to move up with it. And the 50-day moving average will start to curve and come up with the stock as well, but maintaining itself below it. It's going to be very interesting to see how this one plays out. Um, the bears and the bulls are right there. They're wrestling. And we're going to see how this one goes for tomorrow. So thank you for watching.